What's up, everybody? It's Power Sports Steve back at Extreme Power Sports in Opelika, Alabama. Today we are talking about all of the CRF 450s. Look at that. We have one, two, three, four, five different 450s in stock. We're missing two more. Why is there so many? I don't know. Let's talk about them and we'll go from there. And by the way, here's Abby. Hi, Abby. There's Austin. Hey, Austin. Brandy, Nick. Hey, Russ. No one's back over the customer. We won't interrupt him. Jake's hiding in the back. All right. All right, folks. So we're in the showroom today, obviously. Uh, it's going to be loud, so I apologize. All right. First up, 450R Works Edition. Folks, this is the top of the line. If you don't know the Works Edition, then you've been living under a rock. Check this thing out. I'm gonna give you a heads up. I'm gonna say this is not the best looking 450. I'm gonna hold that one for uh, the next bike. But look at this thing. If you want the baddest to the bone, this is it. So you might ask what's new, what is, actually this is, hey did you folks, this is not routed right. There should be something holding this up out of the way. Um, so we'll take care of that here in a little bit. This is new to the showroom floor. All right, so the works edition has the uh, heavy duty wheels, has the Yoshimura exhaust on it, Henson clutch basket, and you see the red head cover. This thing also has custom porting and custom tuning directly from Honda. Check this out. Also has your coating on the front forks. And I don't know why I don't really like the white grips. Um, white grips I think look better, but anyway, it does have uh, the white grips and of course the rim ball fat bars. I mean, this thing is just pretty. Oh, and a custom seat cover by Throttle Jackie. I forgot to mention that. Cool. All right, let's move on to what I think is the best looking 450, and that is this guy. I should have pulled this one out. I don't think I can get a good video of this thing, but check this out. This is the 50th anniversary uh, Honda 450R. These things are very limited. There's only a small number of them made. This is basically a color scheme of the old Honda Elsinore. Why is Abby taking pictures of me? Um, representing, again, the, uh, the pictures on the old Elsinore from way back in the 70s. And no, I was not alive in the 70s. Almost, but not quite. But what's different on the 50th anniversary, you've got the blue, blue seat cover. Hey, Josh. Hello. Making his YouTube uh, debut as well. Uh, yeah, very graceful there. Uh, gold wheels on the 50th anniversary edition. Um, kind of got the custom uh, number plates on it as well. No other mods. Uh, oh, actually, I take that back. You got the gold handlebars as well. Other than that, no other mods on the anniversary edition. No internal differences uh, or anything like that. So then we'll go to the regular brand new. Uh, 2023 Honda CRF 450R looks pretty much like the last model. This year, the bike is all new, pretty much from the ground up. Uh, I know the intake track, exhaust, different things have been changed on this bike. Um, doesn't look much different though from the uh, really from a even a 20 model. Which speaking of 20 models, one of the bikes we do not have is the 23. CRF 450RS um, again looks a lot like the 450R. The S model uh, is really a 2020 CRF 450R. Comes in at a lower price point. Um, it's just not the latest and greatest. Uh, we just sold the one we had on the floor, so I don't have that to show you today. Uh, do, 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 do. All right, for your off-road, what 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 bike is the 450RX made for? Oh, woods racing. Nice. He is correct, folks. All right. So if you're a hair scrambler, um, this is the bike for you. This is the 450 uh, RX model. Um, this bike has the bigger fuel tank, 18 inch rear wheel on the back. A lot of people don't understand why there's an 18 inch versus a 19 inch. 18 inch wheel gives you more sidewall on your tire, which is better for the woods action. Um, let's see, fuel tank, wheels, oh yeah, one more thing it comes with, 
that right there folks kickstand man i tell you i have a woods model myself and the kickstand is so nice you you're not looking for a tree to pop your bike up against or have a buddy hold your bike when you stop um it's it's just it's just the way to go if you ask me uh let's see oh i don't think i mentioned it but these bikes all have the um controls here on the handlebars all the bikes you can see so they have traction control and different power settings we're not going to get into all that today we're just kind of giving a little uh, demonstration of the differences in the models and then that's going to lead us to this guy this is the 450 rl so this is honda's 450 dual sport bike um doesn't quite have the zip that the r models have or the rx uh, but it is a heck of a dual sport uh, in this class a little softer a little more casual riding um just all around good bike just have nice suspension on it again a little bigger tank than what you're going to find on an arm model of course uh, a little softer suspension does not have your um modes on it like the uh, power modes and the traction control but it has your full speedometer uh, all that kind of stuff comes with the mirrors of course comes with blinkers on it um Nice headlight, etc. Kickstand, of course. Tag bracket with your brake light, tail light, turn signals on the back. Look at the difference in the exhaust. You can see the exhaust right there is basically a little more corked up than what you're going to find on an RX or even an R. You can kind of tell. So basically, it's got to pass a noise test, it's got to pass emissions. All that fun stuff because it is street legal as opposed to a race only bike folks that's pretty much it um i have a suzuki back there we're not going to talk about the suzuki today this is all about hondas uh if you have any more questions about the 450 hondas give us a call while we do have them in stock and once again press the like button and subscribe we'd love to see you on the next video and by the way we have a lot more videos coming thank you bye